You're, you're now rocking with the voice of the South. C- Catch 22 radio show on 92kills.com. Yeah, it, yeah. Whoa. No, who? Don't know who. That's not your uh, Apple Juice, the, the juice man. OJ, the juice man. Nobody Wait a knows minute. Him. Yeah, it go in mimosas, duh. <laughs> 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 He does mimosas for a living. All right, y'all, we are back. It's Catch-22 Radio Show. I go by the name of Tay. I have Drewski, and I have Brian in the building. I had to switch it up because I feel like I always put Drew Lack. Drew, what are you doing? I have a paper towel. Guys. That's why you always put him last. That's right there is why you always put him last. <laughs> Drew, <laughs> Drew is shooting me with a paper towel gun. I don't know. It's Who, all I did. He got the loser. <laughs> he got the <laughs> <laughs> it's so hot he losing his mind. It's either that or Escalator gave him one of the mushrooms. <laughs> <laughs> That's her name, Escalator. Escalator sent him to Jupiter. All right, y'all, we have another special guest in the building, and she just took my last napkin, but it's okay. No, she didn't even ask. <laughs> she didn't even ask. She, she just, just reached out. It. <laughs> what's going on, Trish? Hey, Forever y'all. Trish is in the building. What's popping? Hey, what's popping, y'all? We're excited to have you here. I'm excited to be here. Are you hot? I'm not hot yet. It's okay. Like you, gotta you gotta pat. You so our friend. You gotta pat pat. Yeah. Our friend in the uh, back, shout out to Abby. She said we gotta think cold. So think about cold stuff. When okay. I did that, it just made me more hot. <laughs> <laughs> I was using my brain. It was overworking. I was hot. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Oh my God. I mean, y'all was live in here not too long ago, so if it get crunk like that again, then we're gonna be in here. So you just gotta. Oh, hold on, hold on. How old is you? How old am I? Yeah, cause you said crunk. Oh, I said crunk. So certain certain words. Show your age. Give us a range. I know. I'm still in my twenties. Okay. Okay. You good? You good? I I still say crunk sometimes. So what's another word? Lit. lit. Oh, lit. Oh, you know what? I'm real. I don't look. I don't say lit. I'm just saying. Drew, I, what when do you, you say? Said crunk. I was like, yeah, my nephew would have killed you if you said crunk. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, you know that mean old. I'm old. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I was like, oh, bro, that's crunk. That's not live. Yet. He was like, don't nobody say that no more. Yeah. Like, ah, Damn, that's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> so introduce yourself to the world. What is it that you do? All right. So I do a lot of things. Everything. But, uh, most importantly, I'm a trainer. Okay. So What's I've trained train? over at least a hundred clients of my own. Okay. Um, and is this I, like physical training, like yes, mind training? I'm a personal trainer. I do a lot of coaching. I do group training, and I do dance classes as well. Oh. And a lot of boot camp. You ever heard of sex exercise? Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> like, sex exercise is good for you, right? Um, she said she never heard of it. I know, right? I so, think burn a lot of calories. So let me tell you, we had Andrea uh, Andrea Kelly in the oh, building, yeah. and she I... said she was teaching a sex exercise class. Okay. So that's why I was asking, because we didn't get to go, so I was wondering if you was going to teach a class so that we could possibly attend. That sounds very exotic. I would have to um, look into that. <laughs> Don't look into it, just do it. Just, just do, do it. it. Yeah, for sure. Will y'all be there? Of course. Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> We just see your friends. Yes, yes. <laughs> we are there. Huh. I ain't gonna be participating. They be like, who that weird dude in the back just in the corner? <laughs> watching. Watch That's why you're watching me. That's why. Uh-uh. How much? We'll, we'll talk about that. Yes. Okay. So, how did you get into training? Well, first off, uh, what happened was, to be honest, it's a little emotional. Uh, when I was pregnant with my daughter, um, she was born prematurely, and oh. I had to breastfeed, you know, to get her out of NICU. So after I started breastfeeding and they, you know, coached me on how to eat right, I just stuck with it. I did a lot of research on different foods, and my nutrition was everything. Once I started eating right and I started losing weight, I had already been in the gym, like, mm-hmm. full time. But I got in there harder, and I had got a trainer. And with eating right and losing all that weight, getting my baby out of NICU, that was like my, I got so much attention from people I went to school with, just people around the world, period, that used to always message me and ask me, how did you lose weight? Because I start posting transformation pictures and stuff like that. You was like a fat that. girl? I was real big. Now, some people may say, you wasn't even that big, I was big. Because you know what like clothes Like, was you on, under 200 or above 200? I, well, okay, so when I was pregnant, I was like 203. And and I dropped. How tall down. is you? I'm five two. Oh yeah, you was fat. So I was big, right? <laughs> right I was yeah, big. You was fat. And I had health problems. They told me I had high blood pressure. So I'm like, what? 
I had never had health issues, so that bothered me. So once I got rid of that, my doctor was even surprised. She was like, wow, you don't have to take the pills. She was like, but the pills did help you. But little did she know, y'all, I had pill phobia, so I didn't even take the pills. Mm. It was What's just, pill phobia? What is pill phobia? Pill phobia means don't I, she don't swallow. I don't swallow. I don't know how to. I, I you don't know how. So it's not that I don't know how, but I got scared every time, so I always feel like I'm a choke. You just got to close your eyes. No, 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 no. It didn't work. Nothing worked, okay? That, you know something? None of that right My nine-year-old does that. Like, when he gets sick, I be trying to make him take pills. And he swears. I was like, bro, you got a mouthful of yeah, water. Just swallow. You be and like you swallow everything but the pill. It pisses me off. You it's so bad. Yeah, I don't I mean, I'm like, bro, if you don't just swallow this pill. And the pill won't go down. I'm just and gonna they stuff be it down. Too. I'm like, nah. So you been having that phobia, though? I've been having it, y'all. You need some dissolves. Pill phobia. When I went into the hospital, they had to crush up my ibuprofen. They used to give me children's Motrin, like Tylenol. The chewable. That's mm. strong. The liquid. Mm-hmm. That's crazy. I mean, Pill phobia. So are you vegan? I'm not <laughs> vegan, but I did try going vegan for six months, and I did really, really good. And then you was like, uh-uh. No, it's not that I was like, uh-uh, but I went back, back into... Huh? You need that meat back in your life? No, I didn't need the meat back. So I what just, made you do it? <laughs> <laughs> well, I really was. Y'all, listen, I watched What the Hell. I was researching all the food. I was researching, like, the animals we were eating. And it really, like, made me disgusted to the point where I didn't want meat anymore. So what you kind of animals so... we eating? Chicken, cow. I know what they're about. <laughs> First of all, I'm trying to think of what it is. It was disgusting. First of all, yeah, it's I'm, worse eating some of these women than eating chicken and cows. That's true. Uh-huh. I'm, 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 I'm risking my life more doing that than oh, eating wow. that. Oh, well, I mean, certain women, but if she's in the gym training with me, she's good. Chinese people true. eat roaches. You, you train some dirty girls. You no, just don't, I don't know. Train dirty girls. How do you know? I know. know. <laughs> <laughs> is that a requirement? You ain't how he know. You ain't how I know. <laughs> I was saying, so that's like a requirement, like when they feeling it out, like they want you to be a trainer, like, oh no, like, are you clean? And then yeah, they check this. Yeah. Uh-huh. But what if they lie? Like, oh, they serve Because on they race, put... They, put, they make me put black, but I just put other. Yeah. Well, why do you put other? So because they don't I'm know. Other. They're not going to hire you if what you black. What other is you? Uh, I'm <laughs> other than all the other ones on there. <laughs> I'm a mutt. <laughs> I'm all oh, the they above. Say, are you black? No, I, I'm from Mississippi. I'm all the above. I'm a Texan. <laughs> Like, no, what is your you. other texting? <laughs> so you t- let me ask you a question. Okay. Do you turn certain people down from doing it for real? I don't turn anyone down. I help everyone. And to be honest, you guys, before I even got big with training, I grabbed a few girls and trained them for free just because I wanted to test and see if it did really work what I did for myself. And were they big girls? Well, I had two girls that were not really heavy, but they still wanted to see results. Oh. And then I had one girl who was heavy, and she lost um, about 33 pounds within three months. And that's and, and that's with her taking trips and eating still what she wanted to eat and enjoy on the weekend, going out and having fun, not saying, oh, She I lost a whole two, yo. Yeah, she lost a lot of weight, you know, and uh, one girl lost 22 pounds. Hmm. And to me, she was not heavy, but, you know, she, you, you know, lose that weight, and then you turn that fat into muscle, you look different. So What's funny? 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 <laughs> so Brian hey, has, I, I'm gonna let you just put my baby down like that. Hey, you give me something. My baby little too. My baby is 16 months still wearing nine month clothes. And yeah. she walking. Yeah. Oh, that's good. She little. So Brian asked, do you meal prep? Yeah. Yes. I so that's do. like one pizza and everything. Uh huh. Right? We do meal prep. <laughs> Did you hear what he said? Uh-huh. <laughs> she like you you think it too fast. You gotta you know, yeah. You gotta you ask know, what he said. So you put one piece of pizza, you get a box of pizza, right? That's <laughs> what one piece You know what? No, we're not going to do that because you know you don't eat like that. I know. You're working out. I'm, I'm, I am doing keto. I just started. I was really reached out to Trish to try to see if she could train me, but you know what I'm saying? I, I don't know what happened. Hey, people be talking, y'all. See, I be serious. See, and then, hey, now that's look. when you get turned down. When they call, when they message me all the time, mm-hmm. and, then right. they, and then they never show up, I'm like, okay, you know what? You don't want this. Pop up on me. Yeah. And Brian left side of his body don't work. Yeah, so he's going to be a hard task. Oh, for real? When you know that? Yeah. Ask him, ask him to put his thumb up put from the left thumb? side. Nah, 
You know. I mean, <laughs> 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 let me explain to you. I, I, I got another coworker in here that didn't know nothing about this, but yeah, no, I, I had a uh, serious situation. I had. Uh, I don't know what happened. But I've been knowing you all these years. You never told me No, this me just happened like two years ago. Oh, okay, okay. I broke all these fingers. Oh. <laughs> now, every time you try to close hands, look like you got a hand full of sunflower seeds. I can't even beat off with this hand no more. I miss it. Bro, I'm going to the sunflower seeds. Oh, y'all have therapy sessions? Okay, I need to come to that. Oh, well, it's a lot of stuff you can fix. Can that be restored after two years? Yes, absolutely. Okay. It's going to be a high fee. Oh, that is going to be a testimony. You The the time. Definitely a testimony. Because he can't do nothing with that hand. Go to church the weekend after Christmas and let them know that your hand has been restored. <laughs> You're so mad at me. No, I ain't mad. But my question is this, though. Okay, okay. what you mean by happy? How do, how do you determine how much you charge for certain things? Well, all things? my prices are already, you know, they're set in stone, so they're non-negotiable. Now, um, now I do run specials where I do, where I'll say, okay, I have a camp going on, and it's this amount. But um, other than that, they set. And then I have it to where whenever you're interested, that's the first thing they ask, how much you charge. Mm-hmm. And I send them the price list, and we go from there. And then they block you. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, like, not, not so forever, mind. Trish. <laughs> forever, yeah. Trish, well, whatever, Trish. Whatever, Trish. <laughs> Get their money together, or they find a way to come. So up tax with their money. season is big for you. Tax season is big for me, yes. Uh huh. Because some people like they'll pay up in advance, you know. But I try to work with people that's serious. Like money is not a problem when it comes to like if you're serious about your health, because it's more than just the physical appearance. It's the you know the inside too. Yeah, it's, the, it's a mental. The mental, thing. yeah. For sure, for sure. Yeah. All right, y'all. We're about to go ahead and go into a quick break and mix with DJ Anthrax, aka DJ Long Nipples, aka DJ Nice Sweater, aka DJ Crab Lace Front Queen. Beard, DJ Crab Queens, DJ Crab Queens in the mix. You gonna give us a Crab Queens mix? I want a Crab Queens mix. I think it's I a, want a Crab Queens, Queens mix. mix. Yeah, you definitely should do that. All right, y'all, we'll be back with whatever, Trish. It's Catch Way 2 Radio. I want me to do it. I thought it was like an egg roll. Oh, man. Oh, oh yeah, it does that. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all not going to help me. 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 Y'all not going to going to be very important i recommend you all have at least five to six small meals a day Ooh. that includes a lot of veggies your proteins which is going to be your lean meat mm-hmm. you can and also fruit natural fruit not the you know sugary candy not fruit snacks yeah no fruit snacks oh, okay do like strawberries and grapes watermelon stuff like that pineapples okay so can i do like breakfast my woman <laughs> That's why we're trying to sex exercise. Somewhat. It depends. If it's hot like it is in here, then yeah. Oh, so you turn the heat on while you're doing it. Yeah. Uh-huh. Like the sauna. Oh, sauna sex is like that. You gotta work out. I like that. That's a new thing. You gonna pass out trying to have sex in the sauna. You can barely be in there by yourself. You gonna have another human being on you? First of all, think cold. (laughs) You gotta think cold while you're doing it. Ah, whatever. (laughs) You gotta think about igloos. If I think about igloos, then we not having sex. (laughs) So you say you do a lot of things. Dang it, man. <laughs> Just do cut you him do? off, huh? Hey, look, it'd be cool. I'm like, oh, I got it. Then he tell him, like, cool. I got it. It went away. Because when he said, hey, yo, Trish, I was like, he ain't got it. Look at that. 
I got you. Don't need to worry about it. Well, I also sell hair. I have my own hair vendor. Your uh, own okay. hair vendor? Yes. So okay. I do sell hair. What um, you sell? Brazilian, Ooh. Peruvian, okay. Indian. 20 pe- 27 piece doobies. No, we don't yo, do yo, those. No, don't we don't wear them no more. We don't do those. Oh, uh, you don't but do they like do. drawstring ponytails? No drawstring ponytails. No, no, no. no. Ain't no wrong with drawstring. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no,
So you can do it. I like couldn't that. even tell. You I couldn't, couldn't either. Tell, you know? But don't no, let's not do that. There's some women out here. And that they leave out be sticking up. Some people can't do it, but we have closures and frontals for that. So that means you got a good grade of hair. Yeah. Because thank you got you. some over here walking with carpet that can't you. blend. Thank you. I mean, but you know, you still we can make it happen. I can Okay, do it. Fair. I got you. you. Are, I, no, I got you. I got you. I got you. See, look, look, look. See, this is the thing. This is the thing. No, this is the thing. Because okay. I heard that you hang around with pretty women, right? Oh. So when you hang around with pretty women, you really don't have to worry about having to give a compliment to an ugly friend. But I feel like you one of the people that you building up ugly people, <laughs> knowing, knowing yes. that they ugly. Oh, no, 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 no. Not yes, you do. It's it, something beautiful about everybody. That's no. not true. Oh, no, no, no. That is no. true. No. That's a lie. Okay. Well, no. So don't you, think you, so? you probably got like ugly clients. <laughs> like, like, I build up everybody, y'all. I good. always compliment them. It's something beautiful about them, whether it's their personality. Mm -hmm. you know. What if she ugly with a bad personality? Then she's then, just ugly. You know, let me be honest. I know we you having fun, but I pray for my clients. So God send me the right people. Ooh. I don't get them ugly people with them ugly attitudes. So you just get ugly people with good attitudes? Yeah. That's gonna be the talk. hashtag. You know? ugly <laughs> with a good attitude. Go to forever Trish. Go to forever Trish. <laughs> Y'all sneak that one up on me. Oh, yeah. no. So, Boo. are y'all gonna be in Can you on ride this for camp? me? Yes. Uh, what camp? Heck yeah. I really think it'll be dope if we do like a camp for the community. Okay. And go out there. Andrew said he want to DJ because he wants to see He'll DJ. You're going to invite your friends? Yeah, I'm going to invite all my friends. Make sure all they're them? single when they come. Oh, all, <laughs> all of them? All of them. Are they wearing the, uh, your clothing line with the, the tights? Oh, you got oh. clothing line? Yes, I have fitness apparel as well. Oh. We do the crop top hoodies. Oh, I can't wear that. Sleeves. Crop top hoodies. We do hoodies. the high waist leggings. I can't do that either. The booty shorts. I'm going to look like the girls there. <laughs> she definitely cannot do those. <laughs> look, of all things she can't do, she is I not doing the I'm going to look shorts. like that woman that stuck her, uh, stuff her stomach in a drawer. Oh, I do got waist trainers, too. Oh, I need that. Okay. You got girdles? Yeah, we have the corset kind. Nah, yeah, yeah, I need that. So when you come in here, they be like, no, it's working. No, Shout, out Shout out to Trish. No, we not. No, we not. Drew, no, I'm wearing them booty shorts at the camp. Yeah. And I won't be there. Yes, you will. Uh, it's a Catch there. 22 I event. You want to see. Uh, want to see. Want, want to see. <laughs> so is it going to be like a camp camp or is it going to be like a dance class? Because you said you're doing a dance class. Well, we're going to have a DJ and we're going to exercise. The, the DJ going to play us some upbeat music. Okay. Us, you know, I need to you it. to learn sex exercise because I'm trying to do that. See, what I'm trying to do, I'm trying to improve some things. Uh, oh, we do all I need, that. I need this part to be worked out. And yeah, it, uh, <laughs> I don't really get tired though, so I don't know if I need yeah, help with that. Get tired. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> My shoulders get a little tired. You haven't just like. Uh, <laughs> I need stamina training. I think I'm gonna be a trainer for that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. that's a joke. You know, Brian. Look, since you're doing keto, what you know, Brian. Like, since you're doing keto, what you should try to do is planking while you're doing it. You won't even thinking about that you're planking and you you're working on your. Oh form. baby, oh baby, oh baby. How do you feel about keto? I mean, to be honest, if you eat bad and you want to go into keto, cool. But to anybody that's, once you get off of it, go into a healthy keto, meaning take away the dairy, we're going to take away the animal products, and we're going to just limit the carbs and still, like, add the proteins and the veggies. Which, I mean, like you get your proteins from greens, too. You don't have to get it from meat. You're now rocking with the voice of the South. Catch 22 Radio Show on 92kills.com.